make sure that you have shoes that would be comfortable on gliding with. Some people start out with socks, but I suggest shoes because then you'll get the real effect like when you're gliding and you won't be like, ow, oh, why is this so hard to do? Um, so, first of all, bend your right knee, stand like this, or your tippy toe, whatever feels more comfortable to you, and then you move this foot back. So I'm going to call this part one. So, what it basically will look like once you get it um, all together, it's just going to be like that. Those are, that's it. You just repeat it the whole entire time, okay? So, um, remember, bend your knee, slide, and then turn. But when you turn, okay, hold on a second. Getting ahead of myself. Um, okay, step one, part one. Bend, slide, okay? Get that down, press it. Bend, slide. And when you slide, um, you switch. So, like, always remember that when one leg is bent, the other one is straight. You never have both bent or both straight. That would look really weird. Just imagine that. Just be like, <laughs> Okay, so, when you get the first part down, you go straight to the second part. So, the second part is just turning, basically so that you get that whole circle effect when you do the whole gliding together. So, bend, slide, switch. Bend, slide, switch. And when, see how I do that? This foot is on your tippy toe or it's bent. Then this one is kind of just like you're on your heel. I mean, you could do it the other way, just like this foot flat on the ground, whatever you're comfortable with. So, try it again. Bend, slide, switch. And then you do the same thing in the whole circle. So here, I'll just show you like how it goes once you get it down. So bend, slide, switch, bend, slide, switch, bend, slide, switch. Pretty easy. So um, it's the same thing for the other side too. I don't really go the other way because I'm like right-handed and I always start that way um, but other than that it's just repeating those two steps bend slide switch so the bend slide is one part the switching is the second part I hope you guys understand how I just did all that and keep practicing because it's, gliding is one of the most important things I think if you're a popper because it looks so cool instead of just standing there and being all like I'm a tree. <laughs> so, thank you guys for watching. If you guys um, want me to do tutorials for anything else, please comment, inbox me, and I'll definitely do that.